You can see behind me Woodward Avenue in Midtown is pretty much clear. They got a lot of attention on these main streets overnight, but these side streets are a different story. Now this heavy packed snow has become a thick slushy mess and it can be very dangerous. The overnight snowfall piled on our roadways and had hundreds of school districts and businesses closing. But in Detroit's Midtown, no snow day for business owners. <laughs> Monday came like any other morning. Small business owner Callie Bradford says she took her time with the drive in. You just kind of trudge lightly considering that the roads are wet and take your time and it works out just fine. The first big snow of the winter season meant shovels, snow plows and even four wheelers were working overtime. I like shoveling. You like shoveling? Yeah, exercise. I need it. <laughs> Napoleon Jenkins drove into work early this morning to help clear off sidewalks. Did you find yourself fishtailing at all or sliding? Yeah, a little bit. I had to put my truck in four wheel drive, so. Giving yourself extra time to drive is key, especially in the thick brown mess that covers thousands of side streets and neighborhoods. You have to think about not only your own life, but the life of others that are driving. So I like to be extremely cautious. So this is just the first big snow of this winter season. Remember, we're sure to get plenty more, so be sure to take it slow. Reporting from Midtown, Shelly Childers, 7 Action News. All right, Shelly, thanks so much. All right, that's the city there. The suburbs, of course, got hit pretty hard, too, especially in areas up in northern Oakland County. 7 Action News reporter Jennifer Ann Wilson took a look at some of the roads there and had a little bit of fun doing it. Here in Rochester Hills, a lot of the residential streets are getting plowed. You can see we've got a plow truck driver working pretty hard. A lot of pavement right here on Castle Bar, but some of the other side streets like Munster still covered in snow. In fact, the tires on our live truck started spinning. Thankfully, I brought my emergency kit and it comes equipped with a shovel because I really don't want anything to stop me from getting to one of the best sledding hills in town, the Meadow Valley Sledding Hill. It's just one block that way, and our truck can't make it down the street. So, around, I'm about to put in some sweat equity here. Anybody want to help? Right here in Rochester Hills, corner of Munster and Castlebar. I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson. Back to you.